Hey guys, Enthusiast Adventure here. Um, this video is going to be a gear prep and preview of the stuff that I'm bringing with me this weekend on my camping trip. Um, this video is all on the, the little stuff sacks and the little, the little bags that I carry and stuff like that. So, um, let's get into it. Now, the first thing that I have is this like survival two-person tarp poncho thing that can be used to make shelter and stuff like that. Um, I'm probably not going to need this. Um, it just keeps my mom's head at ease knowing that I have this. Um, it's really, I'm, I'm probably not going to use it, but I have it if I need it. Um, my hygiene kit is simple and it doesn't, you know, have too much in it. I'll just run through the, the things that are in it real quick. Just dump them out. Okay, so, um, toilet paper, which can be used, we all know what that's used for. Um, and then I have my toothbrush with one, two, three, four, um, five. My toothbrush, which is one of these, um, you know, two pieces, you pop it together, you pop it out, um, toothbrush. Um, and it has five extra hair bands because I always tie my hair in a ponytail, so I need the hair ties and doesn't take up any room but um yeah standard toothbrush has my name on it um nothing too fancy so i have a toothbrush and just a small thing of toothpaste um gotta keep your your teeth together and stuff like that uh then i just have a small deodorant which smells really good now this is men's deodorant i really don't care that it's men's deodorant because like it just it smells really really good when i'm camping i don't really care if it's men's or women's. It was a free sample at like a Philly game or something they gave them out, so I kept it. And now I use it for camping. Um, 10 plus cortisone, I know I'm gonna need this. I already got eaten alive at my soccer game the other day. Um, and cortisone just, it relieves, might as well use some right now. It relieves um, a lot of the itching and stuff like that. And uh, this is a small little bottle tube of it so it's not too bad um, and then I have just sunblock in this little thing and now normally what I'll put where I'll put sunblock on is my face um, because my face gets burnt pretty easily if I do put sunblock on my bot excuse me on my body it's usually just on the upper arms because they get burnt very well too but usually I'm covered and everything and if not I'll bring like the spray sunblock which I I'm not a big big fan of the spray sunblock but if I have to use it, I will. So that's my hygiene kit. Um, staying on the topic of hygiene and stuff like that, um, I have my first aid kit. You guys have seen the video on this. Um, if not, go check it out. I've got Advil, Tylenol PM, and all the expiration dates. I got band aids, I got tweezers, nail files, um, nail clippers, uh, scissors, a small thing of scissors, and a little mirror, and a bunch of band aids in here. Um, so this is really all I need. And then I have my repair kit, which has two rolls of duct tape that are about 10 feet long each. Um, I've got some cut off some pieces of hot glue gun, the sticks uh, for repairs, various um, needles he going from heavy duty to like an all needle down to fine um, needles. Some safety pins, um, and some yarn, and some, some string, and some stuff like that. And I also have a one-time use um, super glue. So it's a nice little repair kit, gets the job done. Oh, and it also has buttons in it, um, spare buttons for my clothing, and a razor blade. I think I already mentioned that. Okay, the fire kit. I've done a video on this, but um, I'll just go through the contents real quick. I'm going to try to do a couple videos on fire making this weekend. Like I said, it's going to be really hot and there's going to be a lot of people around, but I'm going to try to get one for you. So I've got Stormproof Matches, which I've never really used, but I have them. A lighter that has like barely any liquid left in it, and then I have a whole new lighter right here. Um, just the red with the Ranger Band around it. Um, and then I have cosmetic pads uh, soaked in wax, dipped in wax, and then some Tinder Jerky in this little baggie. Then I have some petroleum jelly cotton balls right in here. Um, two tampons because they work great for fire starting as well. 
And then I have a magnesium rod. I have my fire uh, rod, my flint and steel. And then I have um, a little thing of waterproof matches and a striker. And that's everything that I keep in my fire starting bag. So um, this trip's going to be a lot of fun and I look forward to doing it and shooting some videos for you guys. Um, the weather's going to be pretty hot. So I'll try to get as many videos as I can in. Um, but it's going to be a lot of fun, and I can't wait to see you guys there. And please join me uh, on this trip. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.